Um, let's go over to Illuvium. Exactly. That, that's a spirit. William ring in the house. Um, looking for that more dip, right? That's what we're getting. So, yeah, ILV here, right? Currently $88, right? The cheapest that it's been since basically July of 2021. So over a year, right? And coming down here, I expect this to get some support um, basically above 40 bucks, right? Somewhere between 40 to $80, right? Doesn't mean ILV can't go to new lows, but I would say if Alluvium goes below $40, Mm, if it hits new lows, essentially it's going to have a hard time recovering um, compared to, I would say, other coins, right? So anything that's hitting brand new lows, right, uh, tends to start having a hard time recover from there. So I'd want to see Alluvium hold above $40, but if it does go down to uh, below 30 essentially, right, then it may basically accumulate in those lower levels for quite a long time um, before then basically coming out of here. So Alluvium. Not quite yet, but I would say once it goes below $80, and more importantly, once Bitcoin is below 20000 right, that's where you can start maybe taking a look at, uh, you know, buying heavier on ILV. Uh, and this one is something that I am very, very happy to hold long term and be uh, a main portion of the portfolio. So Alluvium, definitely rock solid. Um, remember the yield on Alluvium, uh, basically the SLP, which is the Ethereum and Alluvium. Uh, liquidity pool, right? That uh, from January, early January, the uh, emissions on that are going to, or, or the basically your interest is going to go down on that. Um, so just FYI on anybody who hasn't yet gotten a position on Luvium, right? That, you know, compounding that over the next, you know, three to four months, that's what you're going to get. Um, and that's, and then after that, things kind of uh, peter away for that. Um, but Luvium is good. Let's go over to Dot and Kusama. Dot is a really interesting one here, um, basically on what its chart looks like, right? And this is its full chart. It's very correlated with Bitcoin and Ethereum, actually, right? It hit a double peak. The first peak here was...